Hey, what up family? Welcome back to the channel. So it's the first unboxing of 2024 and we're gonna kick it off right with a package from our good friend Raphael at Project Retro Games. He sent this big box over. It is filled to the brim. It's got some heft to it. So we're gonna hop right into this. I can't wait to see what he sent us. Big shout out to him. Make sure you follow Project Retro Games on Instagram. I will have a link down in the description so you can check them out. Another big shout out to Radical Reggie, who if he never covered it on his channel, I would have not met Raphael and made such a wonderful friend, such a sweet, loving guy. Absolutely adore him and everything he does. So if you're excited to see what we have today, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And without further ado, get ready to one-up your collection. Let's do it. So let's not waste another second. It's time for Super Fill One Up. Here we go! So fresh and so clean. You gotta love one up power. Mm. Now that we're supercharged, let's see what our good friend sent us. Okay, so we have our package. I already cut the tape, so I'm gonna just pop that open. Ooh, we got a bundle of stuff here. Hey, I didn't know what this was. I didn't know if this was some project retro game stuff or is this just some other thing? So we got Resident Evil 5 for the PS3. I actually do not have this for the PS3. Uh, so that's pretty cool to have. Uh, I do have it on PS4. That's nice. Ooh, a 360 game. We have Saints Row the Third. That's really sweet. Oh, there's like a little paper in there. It is complete. That's awesome. He just sent me stuff. Uh, I guess this is like Christmas present or something. This is pretty neat. Ooh, okay. I did not have this and this is pretty cool because I remember playing a demo of this and I thought it was so groundbreaking. I only played this one. I never played any of the other ones. Splinter Cell, Stealth Action Redefined. Yeah, so we have cool little advertisement in there. I love when they used to do that. Mail, everything complete. Got some sticker labels on there, I have to get off. Though I gotta, gotta say, I love the get the 10% off sticker on there. I might actually keep that. Okay, Oh. Oh, okay. So now we're getting into some of the Project Retro games. Oh man, this is so cool. Look at that gorgeous, beautiful artwork. Absolutely lovely. And let's take a look at the back. Final Fight punches its way onto Sega CD. When the mad gang is around, you know laws are being broken. Enter the good guys, Hagger, Cody, and Guy. With killer roundhouse kicks, back fists, uppercuts, body slams, all raging to the coolest CD quality tunes. When the going gets tough, grab a pipe, knife, or sword and take a slice out of crime. Six brutal levels of street fighting head trauma and shattering rib cages. Choose from three characters from one or two player bone busting action. Arcade quality music and sound effects. Right there you can see his logo, Project Retro Games. So this is a release from him. It looks absolutely beautiful. I remember on the NES, SNES, I just loved beat em ups. Power Rangers, Ninja Turtles, Battle Toads, Double Dragon. I'd really like to play this, but unfortunately, I do not have a Sega CD, so I don't know how I'm gonna play it. But let's take a look at the contents and see what he packed in. And voila, we are back. Here is the CD, of course. Look how pretty that looks. Just beautiful. And then we have the manual. 
with that gorgeous artwork. It's so cool. So much attention to detail in these manuals. Just look at this, all this information to have it printed for you. So you get that authentic retro feel. It's really amazing, really amazing. And it's such a shame we don't get this kind of thing today that often, but it's really appreciated. I just, I'm so blown away by the talent. He, he even went the extra mile to put this, because <laughs> this used to be inside the release. You can't actually use it, uh, at least I don't think, but it's still neat to have. So, yeah, that was the uh, final fight, Sega CD. Uh, mm, had to kiss it. I just, I, I love it. Thank you, man. So here we are, folks, with Resident Evil Zero for the PS1 long box version. Take a look at that gorgeous man. Oh. Ah, I love that. D-Make version. The project Retro Games. Yeah. Instructions, a little bit about the story. Some other information, characters. Oh, I love the blood splatters. Even got a note section. And now let's take a look at this gorgeous, gorgeous disc. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Project Retro Games logo. He does this disc art. This isn't like any other reprints. You can't just like scratch this off easily. This is painted and etched on here. And then let's take a look at the back. So you get screenshots of the D-Make. Looks beautiful. Now, in order to play this, you do need a modded PS1 or PS2. You cannot play this in any PlayStation 1 or PlayStation 2. It must be modded. He does sell modded consoles. So if you're interested, you can look out for that on the store. Um, he will have some other special console bundles coming up. He's already released several that have sold out and they're beautifully hand-painted consoles. But this is fantastic. If anybody remembers Resident Evil Zero was uh, teased on the N64 and that version was scrapped. This is kind of bringing that train station section back from the N64, but on the PS1 with better PS1-like graphics, so. That is really, really awesome. So great to actually have this in the collection. He knows I'm a huge Resident Evil fan, so to have something like this in the collection with the other Resident Evil games he sent me is so awesome. I, I, I don't know what to say. His generosity is just, it blows my mind. So thank you for both of these beautiful treasures in my collection, man. I, I greatly appreciate it. Uh, it looks like my super one-up powers are starting to wear off. Uh, 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 uh. Wow. <laughs> Whew. Well, I guess that means our time's up for this video. I want to thank Project Retro Games, Raphael, for sending this amazing stack of games over. These are beautiful, gorgeous pieces available on his website right now. Do not miss out on adding these amazing games to your collection. I am so grateful and so honored and so blessed to know you. You, you don't even have to send anything to me, but the fact that you do, your generosity is, is just, just amazing. God bless you, and God bless that beautiful new baby of yours and your family. I hope you stay in good health and good cheer. I hope you have a fantastic, successful new year with Project Retro Games. I'm so excited for everything that you have in the pipeline. It's just, it, it's been so, so wonderful getting to know you. But that's it for this video. Let me know in the comments below what you thought of all of these awesome games. Until next time, Happy gaming, happy collecting, and let's all one-up our collection together. Bye, everyone. Game over, man. No, it is